today we're here for Brothers Race. We've got this young fella, Bradley Harris. And I've known him since he was about 15 and been taking him away to races and uh, yeah, he trains hard, he's got the right attitude, he's just a great New Zealander basically. So uh, we've put on a fundraising race for him and so he flies out the 8th of June to go take on the world with Junior EWS. Oh, here he is. The man of legend! Get him! <laughs> uh, pretty excited, eh? First time going away racing like overseas and uh, just excited to meet new people and race internationally and yeah, at a, at a higher level. Yeah. yeah, really looking forward to it. He started off riding BMX and we bought him a mountain bike one year when we shifted up here and yeah he loved it. It was all of a sudden it was all about mountain biking. I think I might have met him doing like some dirt jumps in Alex with a couple of young boys there in like cross country clip shoes on like cross country 29ers doing these big dirt jumps and I seen him sending like this double road gap like with no knee pads like 40 foot sender down this massive run out. Going like 50 k's through the run out, like, I was like, holy heck, that is gnarly. So I was like, this kid's, he's going places, man. It's <laughs> pretty sick. No, I really like the variety of mountain biking, eh, rather than just the same track every day. And I don't know, just met lots more people mountain biking and just really enjoyed it, eh. I think um, what makes Brad so fast is just, I think, his dedication, I think, and self-motivation. Uh, I can't actually. Grow up in Alex. Yeah. Uh, Pretty gnarly. Man. Yeah, it's definitely technical riding, because he grew up in Alex and stuff, so he's real good on the natural kind of terrain, which is a good skill to have, because you, like, you can develop your kind of bike park stuff a lot easier than you can technically. When it's rough and a bit wild, it seems to be pretty handy. Oh, he trains hard, man. Like working full time, and he's you know he's on the wind trainer, and or he's out peddling, and he, he yeah he just loves the grind, eh? But he's just very determined to get to the top. Um, yeah, just a good attitude. He's keen to get after it, and it kind of shows in his riding as well. You know, he puts in the work, so yeah. Hopefully, it all pays off. Mainline with confidence. Yeah, yeah mainline with Do confidence. Do everything. As Cole always says, bite off more than you can chew. Yeah, we're on one yeah. bite more than you can chew. It's good to see the future's in good hands yeah, here with Brad. Um, yeah, I think he's going to go well. So. Yeah. And just enjoy it. He's going to enjoy it, but he's only young. He's got a lot of years of racing bikes ahead of him, so yeah. make the most so. of it. Have fun with it. Don't let it get to your head. Yeah. Say yes to everything. So, yeah, <laughs> always say yes. It'll be good to have enjoy another Kiwi overseas racing with us. So looking forward to it. Don't try and do shit that is going to be too sketchy and come back in one piece. <laughs> be safe. Yeah, be safe. Be safe. And yeah. Just, yeah. Enjoy yourself at the same time. <laughs> Stay on the bike. Go fast. Cool. Yeah, good luck. Wish you all the best, Brad, going overseas. Hope all goes well and hope you smash it. Good luck. Good luck, Bradley. I hope you smash it in Europe. We're all going to be rooting for you. <laughs> Um, thanks Mox for pretty much organising all of it, Ronnie, Jimmy for organising the track, Skyline for having us, and yeah, might see you next year, we could do it again. Bloody yeah. beautiful! The irony is, he was at primary school before we could take training wheels off his first push bike. He couldn't ride one until he was at primary yeah. school. Yeah. 
No way. Yeah, yeah true. Yeah. He, he, yeah. Wow. Yeah. So a lot of people won't know that about him. He'll probably <laughs> hate me for saying it. But <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Absolutely terrible. Just couldn't. He yeah. couldn't. Late starter. Late yeah. Yeah. yeah.